Hello everybody, welcome to PowerPoint Academy. Today, I will show you how to use the PowerPoint as a magnifier to zoom in some details in the images. This is a perfect feature that will help you in your presentations when you try to deliver some information through an image. You can also use this feature to make advertisements of your products through a presentation in Microsoft PowerPoint. But for starting, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel to be able to watch our upcoming free tutorials. Let's go! Okay, so firstly, I will make a plank layout by right click on the slide and choose plank. Then I will crank our photo in this project, Control C and Control V to paste it. Okay, make it more large like this and it's important to bring it to the center of the slide. Then I will choose a color of the background. Okay, this color is fit with the background of the image. And now I will make three covers of this original photo by pressing Ctrl D. Okay, and I will put them here. Then I will put it exactly on the original one. And now choose what part of the image you want to magnify it or make it more large. I will choose this one. Double click and choose crop. Then crop this part only. Like this. And press crop. Now make it more large. and choose this layout which is circular with a black border and try to put it in the same dimensions of the original one okay let's do it again with another part of a picture put it at the center and let's choose this one crop okay Adjust its dimensions like this and click crop. Make it more large. Okay, and you choose the same way out. Then put it in the same dimension like this. Okay. The last one. Center. And I will crop this bowl of coffee. Crop. Okay, make it more large. Very good. Okay, before going to the animation port in our project, uh, I want to use uh, uh, I want to explain to you the concept of our animation. Our animation depends on that we will click on this port in the original photo then this port of the image will appear and all other parts will be disappear so I want to put an object like a circle here to click on it to make it as a trigger to uh, the entrance of this one and I will make three circles but I will hide them and let's do this okay I will put the first one here Control D, second one here, and the last one I will put it in this part. Let's make it more smaller and put it here. Okay. To do your animation easily, to do your animation easily, it's important to rename or give a specific name for each of these circles. So I will make this number one. This is number two. And I will give it number three for this one. Okay, let's hide these circles by making the outline no outline and shift full 
no fill and they will disappear now let's go to the animation port animation pane and make an entrance effect to all of them is a fit now go to each one of them this one ok for the ball click timing tab and triggers check the start effect on click off and choose number one ok this part is number two or this one ok I forget let's be sure this is one three and this is two ok double click timing triggers start effect on click off and choose two same thing double click timing choose trigger start effect on three ok and now I want to hide all of the others in each click so if I click here I want to I want from these two to disappear fade out put them under trigger one and make them with previous ok and when you click on this you want these two to disappear put them under trigger two same thing you want this one these circles to be disappeared put them under trigger three but if you review your project in this way you will find that these pictures aren't appear in the beginning because you put the disappear order for them under the trigger so to solve this problem just choose all of them and give them that appear out and put it at the first of the animation pane okay and now let's review our project okay it appears as an original photo if you want to magnify this part just click on it but if you want to magnify this part just click on it and this one will disappear the last one is here click on it and all of others will disappear and now we reach the end of our video if you like the video please click like and subscribe to our channel to be able to see our upcoming videos thank you